hey guys welcome to my channel so this is just gonna be like a you know a talk um i just actually just want to update you guys so i actually made a video a few videos ago uh where i lost my job probably like uh, it's probably like one of the most devastating things i've ever been through because i've never lost a job before and let me just say this was an hr job basically in corporate one of the top companies and you know in, in the in the world so this was a top job and i lost it so these past four months i have been without work i've literally been drowning my savings like paying all of my paying all of my bills basically just using up my savings and basically whatever i have and i honestly i feel like within these four months i've applied to like over 400 jobs maybe 500 guys that's a lot and out of like the 400 jobs that i applied to i would say i had a total of around like 15 <laughs> interviews um out of the 15 interviews, I had probably about three callbacks. <sighs> and then out of the three callbacks, I got one job offer. So I got a new job. Um, it's an HR. It's in recruiting. So I got a new job. I don't start until the 24th. Um, it was actually supposed to be the 17th, but they pushed it back to the 24th because um, I still have equipment that needs to be shipped so this is going to be mostly a remote job, which is kind of a positive. I don't have to wake up super, super early and, you know, worry about commute and things like that. But i um, really, really grateful here. And I just wanted to share the news. I'm just really grateful because um, these past like four months have been pretty, have been kind of hard for me. Um, anyone who has lost a job knows what it feels like. You know, you feel like your your life is crumbling. You don't know, like, if you're going to pay your bills on time. Like, you don't know what's going to happen. And on top of that, like, your reputation at your last company is basically damaged. Um, I don't know if I mentioned this in my last video, but I didn't quite agree with the reason for why they terminated me i felt like it was a bit harsh um and then you know i looked into whether i wanted to like pursue things legally but i've decided i don't think i'm gonna go that route just because the, the cost that would go into it and you know this is not just some small company that we're talking about here so I feel like for me, just like for the sake of my mental health, that it's just best for me to move on. So moving on to a new job, I'm going to be starting in a couple of weeks, you know, already signed the offer, already went through the background and everything. Um, so I'm really happy about that. Honestly, I just really grateful that I even have a job during this time, during the pandemic. There's a lot of people that lost their jobs during the pandemic, a lot of people that are struggling. So for me, it's kind of like being on that side, I can sort of now sort of, you know, relate and kind of understand what some people are going through. But, um, you know, I just kind of wanted to share the news and you guys have been wondering, okay, so you don't have a, you know, you didn't have a job these past four months. What have you been doing? Honestly, I have not been doing much these past four months have basically been like a vacation like sleeping in because let me tell you guys something at my last job i would have to wake up at like 5 a.m 4 or 5 a.m to get to work um at 6. so these like these past four months i've been sleeping in a lot which has been some it has been nice i'm not gonna lie i've been sleeping in um one thing i started doing was i started getting into fitness i started running so i and it started off as a new year's, new year's resolution but i started running like four to five times a week um i actually just signed up for my first race 
here in San Diego. It's like um like an eight mile race. So I'm really excited about that. I'm thinking about um you know, like making a video on that in the future, just of my fitness. So I've been running a lot and it's sort of, it, and it was just a way to like help get my mind off of things, like just being jobless, just help get my mind off of things. So I've been running a lot. I joined, I joined this like online running program and I joined a few local, um, like running groups um, you know, of course I've been making a, you know, a few YouTube videos here and there. Uh, <laughs> I've been going on hikes. I've been biking a lot, riding my bike. Um, uh, so I've been doing some outdoorsy things. Um, playing video games. <laughs> I started getting back into playing video games. Video games that I used to play in my childhood, they were like, yeah, there were games I used to play in my childhood, like Maple Story and Pokemon and things like that. Um, decorating. So I I haven't done anything major these past four months. Honestly, it's, it feels like a long vacation. I've just been mainly focusing on my fitness. Oh, and I've been trying to teach myself. If you guys see in the back, I have skates. I bought skates a few months back. So I've been trying to teach myself slowly how to um roller skate or is it roller blade same difference but it's actually a lot harder than it looks guys so that's what i've been doing i'm ready to be <laughs> employed again uh, it's been rough guys you have no idea um i've been trying to like go outside and get as much exercise as much as i can for the sake of my mental health, I was just like, you know what? I lost this job, but I do not. I refuse to be down and sad and depressed. I just, these, these months, these like past four months have been kind of rough, but, um, will I be content with this job that I now have? I'm, I'm not a hundred percent sure. Honestly, I will be working this job you know, because I need to pay my bills. But at the same time, I'm still going to be applying to, you know, other jobs out there. Um, ultimately, um, for me, ultimately, down the line, I would love to, you know, go back to school, get my master's in HR. Um, but I would really love to work for a company or even in government that could pay for that. So um, that goal is like still in the works. But for now, I'm just happy to finally have to finally be employed again <laughs> so I can pay my bills. But um, yeah, that marks the end of this video. I'll probably make a, another video too, just like, um, you know, on hair and beauty and things like that. But if you guys have any questions or if you guys experienced something similar um, or if you also lost your job during the pandemic, um, you know, leave your comments down below and I will catch you guys next time. Bye.